At 13 years of age, Kamuti is one of the oldest known leopards in the African bush. Her long life is all down to where she lives. South Luangwa National Park in Zambia. An unspoilt wilderness. Kamuti's territory covers only two square miles. A tiny area for a leopard. But this is no ordinary hunting ground. The mosaic of habitat here, from grassy plains to ebony forests, supports a huge diversity of bird life. Guinea fowl and francolins are very much on Kamuti's menu. And there are more than 60 species of mammal here, including an unusual abundance of her favorite prey antelopes such as impala and puku. Kamuti has been hunting all morning and has killed an impala. This should keep her going for a week or more. But there are other, more powerful predators about. Lions have smelt her success and are on her trail. Before she's even finished her first mouthful, Kamuti is forced to abandon her kill. No point arguing with a lioness more than three times her size. All Kamuti can do is watch from a safe distance. but she's not far enough away for the lioness's liking. Kamuti seeks safety up a tree where the heavier lion cannot follow. The rest of the pride are quick on the scene and waste no time cashing in on Kamuti's kill. Now's her chance to escape. Kamuti, like all leopards, will always give way to lions. 
Not only are they much bigger than her, they are the only cats that live in big family groups. So, they have strength in numbers. But there's one kind of cat that Kamuti will stand and fight. Another female leopard. Five miles to the east is a rival female, Olimba. She's three years old and coming into her prime. Strong, supple, and in perfect condition. Until recently, Olimba lived with her mother. But now, for the first time, she's striking out on her own. This is the start of a new and solitary life. Right now, she's a nomad. What she needs is a hunting ground of her own, with plenty of prey and lots of cover. But the best territory around here is already taken. She won't get it without a fight. She sets out in search of a new place to call home. It's the dry season in South Luangwa. It hasn't rained for more than five months. As the sun beats down, a herd of impala gathers at the one remaining source of water, the Luangwa River. Midday is the safest time for impala to be out in the open. It's too hot for most predators to hunt, but Olimba is hungry. Impala are one of the largest animals she can bring down, and so are top of her menu. But there's no cover on the sandy riverbank. She's chancing it. No chance. A more experienced leopard would have known this was a lost cause. Until she has her own hunting ground with plenty of cover, Olimba is always going to struggle. Her search for a new home is bringing Olimba closer to Kamuti. She's only three miles away from the older leopard's territory and is closing in. Hey, Love Nature fans. Be sure to like and subscribe to catch all our wild animal stories. Get closer to nature right here on YouTube.